<laughs> yeah, definitely. Getting cold out there and we're waiting for the snow as well. Yeah, so we already saw the clouds really moving in. It really was a bright Saturday. We had a lot of sunshine, but now the clouds have returned ahead of this next storm system. Yeah, so snow and cold. Yes, definitely. And unlike last Saturday, we had that mixture of very wet snow. This is going to be a very light, fluffy snow, so accumulations will be much quicker. However, this is going to be a quick hitting snow, so it's going to move through rather quickly right now. Starting to see the leading edge trying to make its way into northwest central Indiana. Some of that really not even making its way to the surface, but anytime after 7 o'clock tonight, we'll start to see that moving into west central Indiana and then invading the rest of central Indiana. These temperatures are primed, ready for that moisture to come in, so it will bring in very cold temperatures, and that will be a snow event only. 17 degrees in Kokomo currently. It's 27 in Columbus. 30 four in Bedford, so quite a bit of a warming difference in South Central Indiana, but the wind chill value is still significant, feeling like nine right now in Kokomo, feeling like 12 in Indianapolis. Now we are expecting this next round of snow, and again, it will be a very quick hitting snow as it's, this system pushes over Central Indiana. We expect to see the fluffy, that powdery snow that will be much easier to shovel than last weekend's snow anytime after 7 p.m. tonight, and that should be done by about two o'clock this morning. If you are driving through it, it will be causing some reduced visibility and certainly some slick spots out there. As we start the timeline here at 7 p.m., you can see future track starts to bring in that leading edge into central Indiana. It will be widespread by about 10 o'clock tonight. And again, because of the cold air in place, and enough moisture, we're going to see the snow adding up pretty quickly. It will move on out of here or after midnight for Indianapolis, about 2 o'clock in the morning for east central Indiana. Here's a look at what we're expecting as far as snowfall goes. Two to three inches. We think this will be the heavier band of snow that moves through anywhere from Greencastle up to Lafayette on up to Rensselaer. And as far east as possibly Marion could see some pockets of four inches or more. But as we look off to the east of that area, it does include Indianapolis. We think that area one to two inches and again it's going to be a very light snow so that fluffiness will allow it to add up pretty quickly. Now as we go into the overnight the skies clear out temperatures tumble we will drop down to two degrees in Indianapolis zero in Greencastle four below zero in Kokomo. So we have a wind chill advisory in effect for Indianapolis points to the north and that is from 3 a.m. tomorrow morning till about 12 noon tomorrow as we will expect to see those wind chill values running from 10 possibly as low as 25 degrees below zero dangerous conditions. Please monitor any time you spend out outside and of course watch out for your pets as we go through tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures struggle to climb into those mid teens. A bitter cold day will be mainly dry as we go into Saturday night into Sunday. We do expect to see another little flurry activity pushing in late Sunday night into early Monday. So a lot to get to in your seven day forecast. Bitter cold conditions for Sunday. We start off at two degrees. Early Sunday morning, high of just 15. Wind chill values running 10 to 25 below zero. More snow showers possible on and off through a good chunk of next week. And we stay well below the freezing mark well into next weekend.